Okay, so what I've done is I've got a chocolate otter who obviously wants to check out everybody else. This is the chocolate otter. She is uh, not even six months old yet, but she's getting closer to breeding age. Um, but she's a chocolate otter. You can tell, you know, again by her color, very chocolatey color. And then I've went and I picked out a black. Okay, now this black here is, this is a boy, I got a boy and a, a girl here. Um, so I'm going to try to do this as quickly as I can. But I just wanted you to be able to notice the difference in what, what is the, the difference is between the chocolate and, and of course the black. Much, much deeper black, uh, darker color. This is so for those of you that are, are really seriously looking at, at chocolates, this is, this is what um, you'd be looking at in the color scheme and to give you the best representation of, of those two colors. Okay, let me get these guys put up. I'll be right back. Okay, so we just saw the, the um, two versions, the chocolate otter versus the black, and you could noticeably tell the difference between the chocolate and the black colored rabbit. Now, what we learned yesterday is that otters are based off of tan, Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to write out the genotypes for A and B, just for these two particular rabbits. And so we know that the chocolate otter is going to be AT. We don't know what that second gene is. And we know that because she is a chocolate, that we're going to be BB. Of course, the rest of the, geno, the genotype is going to continue on down C, D, E, and on, as what we've talked about already. But we're just going to talk about these first two, okay? And then for the black one, uh, obviously black is a self-based rabbit, a self-pattern. We're going to write AA because there's nothing less or uh, less recessive than than self. And then we're just going to automatically go to black. Okay, no space because the space only represents what we don't know. Uh, it's sort of like a question mark. And instead of writing a question mark and having a really messy string that you can't really understand. We just, we just do an underscore there, but since we know what the second gene is, uh, it has to be a self, uh, then in, we do some lowercase a, lowercase a for self, we do a B, capital B for black. We do not know what this gene is. Just visually looking at the rabbit, we do not know, okay? Uh, so I won't confuse you any more than that, okay? Now I do know what is hidden here and the reason I know that is because I know what parents this this black came from so if the black came from let's say which I know came from a black and it also came from a chocolate okay and that black was B okay and the chocolate was BB the only other thing we know that it received at least one black Okay, because it is a black rabbit. We, but we also.